Mbili ni wagumzo sana. Wiki kama moja imepita. Actually bado unasumbua by the way. Eh, bado watu wana maswali mengi tu. Wana maswali mengi husiana hii issue ya ngoma hii ya Uno ambao ukisikiliza beat kama tulivyofanya wiki ile pia nilikuchezea ngoma ya Uno na ya Dundaing. Eh, producer Magix Enga alijitokeza na kusema kwamba um, anachukulia yani mbaya kwamba harmonize alitumia beats za wimbo wake wa Dundaing bila idhini yake mm-hmm. kuitengeneza Uno. Tuko na producer Magix hapa kwenye line ya simu. Mwamo vipi brother? Weshi bro vipi? Yaani Mungu anasaidia kabisa. Sasa hivi unasikika Afrika Mashariki na kwaje? Niko poa mzazi. Alright. Issue ya kwanza mbo ni ya moja kwa moja. Mm-hmm. Baada ya kutoa makataa ya siku saba kwamba utaitoa utaichukulia hatua hii ngoma ya Amunaise. Sasa hivi haipo yeah, kwenye YouTube. Yeah. Umenisoma? Hello. Unanisikia? Ya yeah, nakusikia. Lakini issue mimi ningependa turudi nyuma kidogo. Um, ningependa kufahamu kuhusiana na utunzi wa beat za Dundai. Dundai. Idea na kila kitu jinsi ambavyo ulikuja kuitengeneza pale ikaja kuwa hit. Dundai, okay, Dundai ni trap ni make uh, from scratch kwanza kick, mea, piano, everything. Mm-hmm. Uh, guitar. Mm-hmm. Na the song, song ikafanya vizuri sana. We have like 4 million views on YouTube. Aha. Ya na kusikia harmonize ame sample. Aha. Uh, Dani kuna venye tunaweza kuona two two hit song on YouTube mm. with the same vibe. Mm-hmm. So nikampatia harmonize one week a delete song. Mm-hmm. Of which the guy I think amekuwa ni superstar sana yani. Mm-hmm. Kama hakuwa na respect pia aka akaona hata si asijibu yani mm-hmm. aka block hadi Instagram. Oh aliku block alini block instagram na hako na namba yungu ya whatsapp saa siji shida ilikuwa ni wapi yungi ni pigia ni ambia bro uh-huh. nime sample ni sawa lakini uh-huh. tuneza tukongea jamaa kuongea mande ok so ulijaribu ku, kumreach out kupitia kwa simu kumpigia ama kupitia kwenye whatsapp yeah, kumtumia yeah na kumreach out siku si kumambia anything ili post but yeye yeah, kama msania na faa kuona one ee hey, nyele hapa ni sample na faa kwanza hata before sample na faa uh-huh. kuongea na artist uh-huh. ni before ni sample project tuwa na ongea na the owner of that project so hivi yeah. magics by the way Yeah. Hivi angekuomba ruhusa kuweza kusample your beat ungekuwa na shida. Si, ah, uh, yes, sasa tunaelewana. Unajua ni muziki ni biashara pia yeye anatengeneza pesa huko. So tuna uh-huh. tunaongea tunajua okay, I'll pay this amount then I'll sample your beat. Uh-huh. Ama nitafanya hivi na hivi. Yeah, communicate. That's when you one week na one week, one week imeisha leo na nime delete the song uno. Okay. Yeye Tanzania walikuwa wanauliza ni aje au kuna uwezo gani wa ku delete? Aha. The song but the song is no longer on YouTube. Sasa kabla ujatueleza jinsi ambavyo umeidelete kwenye YouTube ningependa uh, ku raise a few issues. Kuna baadhi ya watu ambao wanakufuatilia na watu ambao pia wanafuatilia muziki waliwahi kusema kwamba uh, pia wewe ulitumia uli uh, ulitumia uh, beat ya Motik Bana. Olamide. Ya Olamide. Yeye mimi 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 hivyo maybe maybe, 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 maybe Olamide angange report ye mwenyewe aseme Magic Senga ame sample sawa yeye ningekubali toleo sawa. Lakini pia yeye inakaa amesikiza ame wana hit track. Hata I think yangu ilitoka mbele yake. I'm not sure. Ya ya kwake ilitoka. ilitoka. Yako ilitoka 3 months August, after yake. Okay. Yako ilitoka mwezi Oktoba. Yeah. Yeah lakini saa yetu tule record kitambo sana okay kwa hivyo uh, imekuwa tu kwa hivyo hii hi ngoma ya dundaing wewe hauku sample kutoka kwa ulamide ulamide sample any project maybe hata huyo ulamide ni ame sample <laughs> ah okay yeah, sample project yote man okay so umechukua hatua gani kuhakikisha kwamba hii video ya uno ya harmonize imetoka kutoka kwenye youtube umechukua hatua gani mimi tumia tu njia zangu za kama jikrenga na nikatoa you know, things watu walikuwa wanataka kuona nini inaweza happen mwanzo wa Tanzania walikuwa wanaongea vibaya sana mm-hmm. na hii kitu shay happen before na vile Paul na wa Kenya wako it experience mm-hmm. walikuwa wanang'ana peke yake vile na za mm-hmm. akaripota akafanya nini basi mm-hmm. now the song is not on youtube so at least what a respect wa Kenya na what a respect muziki wa Kenya unaweza labda kutu, kutubegea siri na kutuambia hatua ambazo umechukua labda uli, 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 uli zungumza na watu wa youtube una ni mambo ya kwangu tu eh mambo ya kwangu tu inabaki hivyo hivyo ufai ku sample magic anger beat aha okay so mtu mm. yote akijaribu kuchukua uh, beat yako yote popote alipo duniani unachukua hatua zote kama ni Chris Brown na mka subi na delete what okay. you did is it legal magic anger 
Wele, mina kukambia ufaisi sample biche magic senga Mina ni kukambia But is it legal? Na hapo siku ni kukambia kuna some new ideas of how I can make this music sound is, better Alapo Is it legal? Na kukambia na follow the same thing and a sample <laughs> Okay, so um, Kakadote ka nauliza kukambia hatuwa mbozo mechukua nizi hatuwa za kishiria Za kishiria ama ule backdoor Black market <laughs> my friend Nime tumia za kishiria mzazi manake nilimbatia one week Mhm mm uh, Adan ilikuwa ni siku saba uh, I think kakaangalia kwa wanauni kijana tu yaani Wacha tu yafanya kitu watafanya Sasa oh. I think sayi ata atanijua kuzuri Ok um yes yeah. Kwa mundo ni rudisha track youtube Baada baada ya kue kuitoa kwenye youtube Hame ku contact uh, Kuna time nilikuwa ta call Za whatsapp But since then ya unatena so, oh, Hame kupijia kupijia kwenye whatsapp Eh ni na hiyo namba. Kuna namba kuna jo harmonize shape shape atana tena shape shape fanya hata apart from music shape atana kwa biashara nyingine pia. Okay. So uh, iwapo i atakuomba radhi na um, labda kubaliane na eh, uta utairudisha video, utairudisha kwenye YouTube ama kitu gani nafaa kutarajia? Why not? Tunaweza ongea watu ongea. Sasa shida ni yeye communicate. Sasa yeye nimetoa kwanza YouTube. Aha. Uh, then sasa tunaweza ongea. Alright, kwa hivyo hatua yako ya kutoka kwenye YouTube sio kwamba sio permanent. Ni permanent, naweza mwa zirudishi sim tu kuna dundai, unajua tuwezi kuwa na remix. <laughs> ah. Na yeah. iwapo utairudisha. Mimi lakini like kwenye imefanya ni toa hiyo track kabisa ni ile yani heshima yeah. tu kidogo yani ile ku communicate ni muhimu. Haja kufanyia heshima. Eh, uh, anafaa ku respect pia eh uh, pia sisi ni wasanii huku venye yeye ni superstar huko Tanzania huku yeye ni superstar. Okay. So langu ni hili hapa. Iwapo mm. utatakiwa kurudisha hiyo video ama ataku, atakuomba urudishe. Matakwa yako ni gani? Makubaliano yako yatakuwa ni gani? Kitu gani ambacho unahitaji kiekwe sawa ndio urudishe. Uno. Tongea kielewana nitarudisha lakini sasa itakuwa ni mara ya mwisho msanii wa sample limbo. Any track Kenyan track. Hakuna mtu anafaa ku sample track ya mtu yani. Aha. Mwanzo yeah. hapa Kenya kuna five. Je, yeah, utahitaji harmonizer kulipe pesa yoyote kwa kufanya hivyo? Ah, sasa kifesa. Unataka tu kuonyesha heshima. Sio kidogo, pesa zake akae nazo tu huko. Aha, kwa hivyo wewe hutaki pesa? Unataka tu heshima. Unataka heshima. Heshima ni dogo. Pesa reset tu kidogo. Apige simu aseme pole, ni sample nifanye hivi sawa na mrudishia track yake YouTube. Wow. Magix. Yup. A question, one of the uh, what conditions kurudisha track yake pale kwenye YouTube? Do you think you probably ask him to apologize also kwenye Instagram, ku post? Ama utahitaji afanye public apology? Aposta sema kwa wale manze itabidi <laughs> Akicheza pia natuwa pia audio Nimeona audio kwa YouTube Sikuwa nimiangalia Aha, Kwa hivyo uh, unawezo pia wakutoa audio kwenye YouTube Na waza nikatoa na hivyo mpati ya siku mbili I see Aongea <laughs> juu vile tafanya Hata wezi natuwa pia hiyo audio Ajaribu kutoa tracking ina mpia Nimejaribu kuhusiana na harmonize hapa Ni kamuliza inakuwaje um, um, Kuhusiana na hii issue Hame ni tumia ujumbe ya kanambia tunalifanyia kazi anawajibika iwapo je atalabda atarudisha video bila kupitia kwa um, hakuna shida kirudisha saa wanatoa tena na uwezo una uwezo kuitoa tena anytime any day ok neno lako langwisho kwa mashabiki mbola kufatulia na kusikiliza sa hivi afrika mashariki amine za wambia tuwa zidi tu kusapot kenya music kwanza kama sa hivi genge tu ni meshika hivi yaani aha Eh hey, watu wana appreciate Kenya wa Kenya wanafanya hiyo ina five yani waendelee ku support. Aha. Magic Anger Beat King hapa ndazidi kutoa hits. Hapa ni hits after hits. <laughs> Alright. Sasa hivi tunakula kucheza ngoma ya Dundaing. Naomba uitambulishe hewani uelezee tu kwa ufupi kuhusiana hii ngoma idea na ulivyoamua kuwakalisha magwiji kwenye hii beat. Ah uh, Dundaing. Yeah. Ah uh, Dundaing ni ni track uh, tulengea studio mimi na King Kaka Christoph. Mhm. Mm Actually nilikuwa naenda kuwafanyia collab yake King Kaka na Christoph. After that session though nikasema ah uh, we can start something from scratch nione tunaweza fanya nini na ndio ah. tukatengeneza Dundain. Okay. Nilikuwa like ni ku have fun. Na right. Tukatengeneza kitu poa ika happen kwa hip hop. Aha. Yeah. Okay. Asante sana uh, ndugu yangu Magic Nenda kuongea nasi kupitia kwenye mambo msetu ya Radio Citizen. Anytime mzazi Shukran sana Uyo ni Magix The Beat King Magix Enga mtu wangu Na hey. yapa kazi ya mwena dundoka Ni dundaing katika mambo mseli